it's April and welcome to my toy world. Today we'll be opening up some fun new Smurf toys from Smurfs the Lost Village. I have two fun Smurf houses here, Smurfette's house and Barani's house, the cute little mushroom houses. They come with such cute furniture and little figures and then I also have four of these figure packs as well with some of the original Smurfs and some of the Smurfs from the new Lost Village movie. I found all of these toys at Walmart. So let's go ahead and take a look at some of these cute little figures here. We'll start with the figure packs first. This is Smurfette and in here is a hidden figure, but on the back you can see all of the figures that you can collect in this little um, box series here. Papa Smurf, Hefty Smurf, Smurfette and Clumsy Smurf, as well as Smurf Willow, Smurf Storm, Smurf Blossom, and Smurf Lily. So let's go ahead and open up Smurfette's pack and see who she comes with. So here's the little Smurfette figure from this pack, and here's the second figure it comes with, one of the Smurfs from the Lost Village, and this is Smurf Blossom. You can see how cute she has a little um, flower in her hat there, and here they are together. You can see that the original Smurfs have white outfits, and the Smurfs from the Lost Village have sort of a cream-colored outfit there, and she also has blue hair. So that's really pretty cute. I am so looking forward to seeing this movie. I absolutely love Smurfs. I watched Smurfs growing up as a child and I've seen some of the other movies and I'm also really really excited to see Smurfs Lost Village movie. So those are the first two figures and now let's go ahead and open this one here with Papa Smurf and we'll see the hidden um, Lost Village Smurf there. So here is Papa Smurf and he comes with Smurf Willow and Smurf Willow looks like she is also one of the leaders. I haven't seen the movie yet so I don't know but since she's wearing a red hat like Papa Smurf and she also has gray hair. I think she might be one of the leaders of the Lost Village just like Papa Smurf is with the regular Smurfs. So that is Papa Smurf and Smurf Willow there, which I think is really, really cute. And I think she's so cute with her gray hair in the little ponytails. I think that's adorable. Um, again, I'm super looking forward to seeing the new movie so I can find out more about that new character. And here's our next pack. This is Hefty Smurf and Smurf Storm, it says. Okay. So here is Hefty Smurf here, and you can see his little heart tattoo and his strong chest there. He's got a heart on that side as well. And this is Smurf Storm, a character from the Lost Village. She's got like a blue top on her outfit here and a pretty flower in her hat. So that is that pack, Smurf Storm and Hefty Smurf. And also I recently opened the blind bags from the Lost Village as well. So I have a bunch of other figures also that I've recently opened up. So be sure and check out that video. I'll go ahead and link it below. And here is the last two pack here. This is Clumsy Smurf and Smurf Lily. So here is Clumsy Smurf and you can see his head moves and his arms kind of move like this a little bit. And that is him. He's pretty cute. And this is Smurf Lily. She's got an orange lily in her hair. And she's got a bunch of um, ponytails, little round ponytails in her hair, which I think is totally adorable. And she is just really, really cute. I'm getting more excited for this film now that I've seen all these cute little characters. So these are the eight characters that you can get in the two pack. And then they also have these two houses, Smurfette's Mushroom House and Brainy's Mushroom House. I have always loved the Mushroom House. Houses. I really love mushrooms. I think they're super cute and I think that the Smurfs mushroom houses are always adorable. I have some Smurf houses from previous collections but I do not have this type of pink Smurf house or a Brainy's house so I'm super excited to be adding these to my collection. So let's go ahead and check out Smurfette's mushroom house first. So here's her house. It has sort of like a hot pink um, mushroom top there and you can see there she is with some furniture and it looks like it opens up um, and you can close it like this. It says Smurfette's mushroom house and then on the back here it shows a little bit more about it it includes smurfette and there's her house and it shows some of the furniture in there it says includes smurfy accessories and then here it says smurfette and her best friend brainy clumsy and hefty go on a thrilling adventure through the forbidden forest a mysterious place filled with magical creatures to find a secret lost village before the evil wizard Gargamel does. Oh, so that is exciting. That tells us a little bit more about the um, movie there. And here it says, collect them all. And then it shows Brainy's little house here, which we'll open up next. Okay, so I'm going to get this out of the package and I'll be right back to show you what this looks like. Okay, so here is Smurfette's house. You can see how it opens up. You can just clip it together here. And this is what it looks like when it's closed up. It has little windows that have little shutters here that you can open and close. 
which I think is really cute, as well as this little window here that opens up also. And then the door also opens up, which is really, really cute. And then you can just open it here on the side, like so. Just like that to reveal the inside and you can see the little fireplace here and the inside of the house. It does come with these stickers that you could probably use to decorate the inside of the house. I'll probably do that later um, just so I can be really careful that the stickers go in the right place. And you could also probably save these Smurfette stickers for another project because it comes with a little Smurfette so she can just sit inside her house right here. And then it also has a bed, which I think is really cute. I love the little pattern on the um, bedspread there. We'll put this actually upstairs here, just like that. And she could lay on the bed if she wants to take a nap. And then it also comes with a little table here or a little bench, which you could put upstairs by the fire. And then a cute little kitchen table here with a little tablecloth and it looks like little flowers in the center there or perhaps a little cake that you could put downstairs. So she could either be in her room asleep or she could be down here at the table or she could be upstairs here sitting by the fire, which I think is so cute. So those are the little accessories she comes with there. And I'll go ahead and set this in the back here and go ahead and open up the next one. And in the end, we can add some of our other figures as well. So here is the next pack here. This is Brainy's Mushroom House. And you can see Brainy here and his house, which has got a blue top to it and some fun accessories. And here's the back. It says it includes Brainy Smurf. And there's a picture of the house as well as some of his fun accessories. It looks like a fun bookcase there and a chalkboard and a desk because he likes to study because he He's Brainy Smurf. Okay, so I will go ahead and open up Brainy Smurf's pack here and we'll take a look at his house. So here is Brainy Smurf's house and you can see how cute it is. I love the blue top here. His little shutters upstairs open up as well and also this window here and the door just like in the other house. And here's the little mailbox. The other house had that too. And this is what it looks like on the inside. Pretty similar to Smurfette's house. And this one also comes with a sticker sheet that you could use to decorate inside the house or for another craft if you'd like. Looks like a bunch of fun things there that the sticker has on it. I like the little chalkboard there. And here is a chalkboard that it comes with as well that you could just put in here upstairs if he wants to study upstairs perhaps. And here is Brainy Smurf, the little figure that comes with this. We'll put him by his chalkboard. And I really love this here. This is a little bookcase. I love books, and I think that this bookcase is so cute. We'll put that downstairs here. And then it also comes with a little bench, just like the other set did. And we can put that also by the fire up there. I also just realized I forgot to add one of Smurfette's little things to her um, house. It also came with this shelf. So I'll go ahead and set that in the back and we'll add that to her house in just a second. And Brainy's house also came with this really cool desk here with a little magnifying glass that you can um, flip down or flip up so he can look at his papers up close, which I think is really neat. And we'll go ahead and put that downstairs by his bookcase. So that is that set. I think it is so fun. I love all the little details and accessories that these come with. And I also think it's really nice that it comes with a little figure. So I'm going to go ahead and set this up in the back and we'll add some of the other figures to both houses. And we can put this little bookcase here in her um, dining room there. It looks like it could be a nice thing, a little shelf for her dining room. And I'm going to go ahead and add some of the different figures to their houses. Their friends can be visiting. So there are all the figures in the houses. So it looks like there's a lot of room for everyone to fit in the houses. Here is Smurfette's house again. I've put a bunch of different figures in there. Papa Smurf is upstairs and Smurf Lily's down there, as well as Smurf Willow and Smurf Blossom. And over here in Brainy's house, I've got Brainy and Clumsy and Hefty, as well as Smurf Storm and another Smurfette figure. So I think it's so cute that you can use the little figures in both of these houses. It's a really um, fun little set here. I just love these and I'm really, really looking forward to the movie so that I can learn more about the new Lost Village story. So I think these are really cute and I'm very glad to be adding these to my collection. I absolutely love Smurfs and I think these little houses and play sets are so cute as well as all the little figures. I hope you enjoyed taking a look at these Smurfs Lost Village play sets. Again, I found these at Walmart. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Hit subscribe for more videos from April's Toy World. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you later. Goodbye!